thinking about everyone in Charleston, South Carolina right now. The spirit of Charleston will carry on. Services tomorrow and Emmanuel AME Church will go on. And in the ninth minute of tonight's game, there will be a moment of silence for both fan bases, the battalion, the regiment, and Jack's Militia. And our thoughts right now are with everyone in Charleston, South Carolina, along with the entire country, as certainly we're thinking about them and we're thinking about all of you as well. So let's sit down and enjoy a wonderful soccer game together. Game between these two teams. Chips one of the box right on, and then the header goes awry. Run by Griffith. He'll take it into the box down to the right. Sends a cross. Boyd will stop that before it goes out of play. Another cross. Kelly had an opportunity at it, but Gilstrap couldn't quite get his hand on it. Kelly, once again, did not get the motion he wanted off the ball. Opportunity to put the ball in the box and create chances as we see Here's Kelly, Kelly go away here. He'll go for distance, and Gilstrap got that one in his hands. USL2 championship. Here's Kelly once again taking in on the mouth of the goal from the left foot, and the shot bounced off the shoulder of Gil. Fortunately, it's not a baseball, though. Chip comes in. Newton with an excellent attempt, and it took a short hop over the net. And it had to be played by Colby. I'm here. Martinez curves one in, and the shot put on goal! Goody, goody, gumdrops. Van Shake will send in the corner, and it delves in its goal. That was a tricky one, and what a corner that was by Jared Van Shake, who scores his first league goal of the year as we approach 8 o'clock. Van Shake, another dangerous ball, headed on. Gilstrap made the save. Wins the race over the end line, tries to move on against Ferguson, puts on the shot, and a great save made. The rebound goes off the outside of the net. Of Ferguson inside. The six yard box there. Here's Herrera at the edge of the box. Ball chipped in, right from the box. It's the Horsky. Goal! White whale, holy grail. Thomas Horsky scores. And it was a long time coming, but it's his first USL goal. And it could very well give Charlotte a win in their first game at Ramblewood. But the intent there was by Martinez, and he told them to move it. And there's the final whistle. And Charlotte Independence has gained a victory in their first game at Ramblewood Soccer Complex. Tomas Zaharski scores the game winner on an assist from Jorge Herrera. It wasn't a goal at the very end, but it came late in the contest in the 88th minute, and Charlotte has completed a tremendous week in this young franchise's history with a win here tonight over Charleston Battery. And Charlotte now with its fourth home win as they are now 4-4-3 four, four, in USL.